respect, this is me, Apache India, and this is the Reggae Revolution, and you're watching Echo for the World! Our planet is calling out for help, and companies are answering with environmental and sustainable development. In Cambodia, the high street chain H&M educates its employees about the risks of HIV and AIDS. The textile industry forms the backbone of Cambodia's entire economy, more so than any other country in the world. It accounts for 80% of exports and employs a quarter of a million people. But textile production is notoriously pollution intense, especially in the developing world where regulation is often insufficient to protect the local environment or workers' health. The dyes used for the clothes can be highly toxic and even carcinogenic. But the high street clothes chain H&M is striving to change this. In the Wing Hong factory in Phnom Penh, chemical restrictions ensure that workers are never exposed to chemicals that could harm them or the environment. We try our best to keep the environment clean for the workers. Our workers never come into contact with chemical substances which are harmful. Workers in Cambodia face threats that aren't just from the production line. One element of sustainable production is an improved working environment, which means protecting workers not only from hazardous chemicals, but from the threat of diseases such as HIV and AIDS. Cambodia has the fastest growing number of HIV cases in Southeast Asia, and the 300,000 people that work in the textile factories in and around Phnom Penh are particularly vulnerable. In Cambodia, you have a lot of young people migrating from the province to the city to find a job in, in Phnom Penh. And uh, for most of these young people, it is the first time that they are away from their family and the first time that uh, they come to the city. Therefore, I think it is essential that these workers are equipped with the knowledge and with the skill to protect themselves. Young Cambodians are being educated about the threat of AIDS and prevention, as well as preventing discrimination against those already infected. The activities that we are doing in the factory are a combination of education and also theater intervention. We train a 75 peer educator and then their role will be to contact other workers to pass the message about HIV AIDS. The objective of the theater intervention is to reinforce the message delivered during the education activities. But with the theater intervention, you can have an audience of 400 people at a time. I like this work because I like to be involved in the performing arts. I also like it because it's about educating people through performing arts. Also, it's very interesting because I learn a lot about the issues I'm delivering in the performance. My name is Monza Pang. I am 23 years old. The performance makes the workers happy, and we learn at the same time. The alliance between H&M and UNICEF has shown how business partnerships can work to tackle some of the biggest issues facing the developing world. We feel that we have a moral responsibility towards uh, all the people participating in the production of our products. I learned a lot from the life skills lesson and the drama. I have knowledge about how to protect myself from HIV and AIDS. I think I will have a good future because I know how to protect myself.